Welcome Time Talkers, to a voyage through the stories of time, where today the sands of Mesopotamia whisper tales of an ancient civilization. In the land between the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, the cradle of civilization emerged, flourishing from 4500 to 1900 BC. Join us today on Talks with Time as we unravel the enigma of the Sumerians. Mesopotamia, often referred to as the cradle of civilization, is the region where Sumer emerged. Situated between the Tigris and Euphrates rivers, its fertile plains facilitated agriculture and the growth of early human settlements. Sumer was located in the southern part of Mesopotamia, encompassing modern-day southern Iraq. The geographical features of ancient Sumeria were characterized by flat, marshy terrain, prone to flooding during the annual inundation of the rivers. To control these floods and harness the waters for irrigation, the Sumerians developed sophisticated systems of canals and levees, enabling agricultural productivity and the sustenance of a dense population. Major cities and city-states within Sumerian territory included Uruk, considered one of the earliest urban centers in the world, Yor, renowned for its ziggurat and association with the biblical figure Abraham, Lagash, known for its powerful rulers such as Gudia, and Nippur, a religious center dedicated to the god in Lil. The history of Sumer dates back to the 4th millennium BCE when the Sumerians settled in the region. They established the world's first known form of writing, known as cuneiform, which was initially used for administrative and economic purposes, but later evolved into a sophisticated script capable of expressing literature, law, and religious texts. Sumerian society was organized into city-states, each governed by a priest-king, known as a ensi, or a council of elders. These city-states often engaged in territorial conflicts and alliances, leading to periods of warfare and consolidation of power. The Sumerians made significant contributions to various fields of knowledge, including mathematics, astronomy, and law. They developed a sexagesimal system of counting, based on the number 60, which influenced the way time and angles are measured to this day. The Sumerians also observed the movements of celestial bodies and developed the earliest known written records of astronomical phenomena. Sumerian society was stratified into distinct social classes, with the ruling elite consisting of priests, bureaucrats, and military leaders, followed by merchants, artisans, and farmers. Slavery was also prevalent in Sumerian society, with slaves performing various labor-intensive tasks. Religion played a central role in Sumerian culture, with a pantheon of gods and goddesses presiding over different aspects of life. Chief among these deities were Anu, the sky god, Enlil, the god of wind and storms, and Inanna, the goddess of love and war. Sumerians built elaborate temples called ziggurats to honor their gods and offer sacrifices. Daily life in Sumeria revolved around agriculture, with farmers cultivating crops such as barley, wheat, and dates. Trade flourished in Sumerian cities, facilitated by the development of a complex system of weights and measures and the use of clay tablets as a form of currency. Sumerian architecture is best exemplified by the construction of ziggurats, massive stepped structures topped with temples dedicated to the gods. The most famous of these is the Ziggurat of Yore, built around 2100 BCE by King Yornamu of Yore. These monumental structures served as religious centers and symbols of the city-state's power and prosperity. In addition to ziggurats, the Sumerians were adept at engineering irrigation systems to manage the flow of water from the rivers to their fields. Canals were dug to divert water to areas that required irrigation, allowing for the cultivation of crops even in arid regions. The Sumerians also developed advanced techniques in pottery making, metallurgy, and textile production. 
Artisans created intricate pottery vessels decorated with geometric designs and figures depicting scenes from mythology and daily life. Sumerians were prolific writers, producing a vast array of literary works in cuneiform script. Among the most famous of these is the Epic of Gilgamesh, an epic poem that recounts the adventures of the legendary King Gilgamesh and his quest for immortality. Other notable literary works include hymns, myths, and religious texts. Education in ancient Sumeria was primarily the domain of scribal schools, where aspiring scribes were trained in the art of writing and record-keeping. Students learned to master the complex cuneiform script and were taught subjects such as mathematics, astronomy, and literature. Trade played a crucial role in the Sumerian economy, with merchants exchanging goods such as textiles, pottery, and precious metals with neighboring regions. Sumerian merchants traveled along trade routes that extended as far as the Indus Valley to the east and Anatolia to the west. The Sumerians developed a system of standardized weights and measures to facilitate trade and commerce. Clay tablets inscribed with numerical symbols were used as a form of accounting, documenting transactions, and keeping records of debts and credits. Sumerian art is characterized by its realism and attention to detail, particularly in sculpture and relief carving. Artists produce statues of gods and rulers, often depicting them with exaggerated facial features and elaborate headdresses. Relief carvings adorned the walls of temples and palaces, depicting scenes from mythology and religious rituals. Craftsmen in Sumeria were skilled in working with a variety of materials, including clay, metal, and precious stones. They produced a wide range of objects, including pottery vessels, jewelry, and ceremonial weapons, many of which have been unearthed by archaeologists and provide insights into Sumerian craftsmanship. The decline of Sumerian civilization was gradual and multifaceted, resulting from a combination of factors such as environmental degradation, internal strife, and external invasions. The region was eventually conquered by the Akkadians, followed by the Babylonians and Assyrians, who built upon the cultural and technological achievements of the Sumerians. Despite its eventual decline, the legacy of Sumeria endured in subsequent Mesopotamian civilizations and beyond. Sumerian innovations in writing, mathematics, and law laid the foundation for future developments in the ancient Near East and influenced the cultural and intellectual traditions of later civilizations, including the Greeks and Roman. Ancient Sumeria stands as a testament to the ingenuity and creativity of humanity's earliest civilizations. From its humble beginnings as a collection of city-states in the fertile plains of Mesopotamia, Sumeria rose to become a center of innovation and culture, leaving an indelible mark on the course of human history. Though millennia have passed since their time, the Sumerians remain immortalized in the annals of human progress. Their story, etched in clay, serves as a beacon of inspiration for generations to come. As we bid farewell to this ancient realm, remember to keep exploring and keep learning because the echoes of the past shape the ideas of our future. If you've enjoyed our journey through the annals of history, don't forget to subscribe to our channel, give this video a thumbs up, and leave a comment below sharing your thoughts or any topics you'd like us to explore in the future.